Sam is a library mouse, and his home is in a little hole in the wall behind the children's reference books. Sam knows a lot about the world, but he's never been outside the library before, until now. I'm Daniel Kirk, creator of Library Mouse, and I'm here just putting a few finishing touches on the cover of my new book. In Library Mouse, a museum adventure, Sam's best friend, Sarah, talks him into taking a trip to the art museum right down the street from the library. Sam's a little nervous about leaving home, but he decides that if he and Sarah bring along their journals, they can take notes on everything that happens during their adventure. It's the middle of the night when they get to the museum. It's a little dark and scary there. But Sam and Sarah start exploring right away, and before long, they're writing and sketching in their journals. There are a lot of things for Sam and Sarah to see in the museum. Statues from ancient Greece, fossils from the Stone Age, ancient artifacts from faraway places like Egypt. There are paintings from all around the world in every size and every style, and even suits of armor from the Middle Ages. Sam and Sarah don't realize, though, that on every step of their journey, they're being followed. Without giving away the ending, I'll just say that these two little mice are in for quite a surprise. Now, with each of the Library Mouse books, I try to tell a good story while at the same time giving kids some pointers about the writer's journey. The first book, Library Mouse, encourages children to see themselves as writers. The second book, A Friend's Tale, talks about the different ways authors and illustrators go about telling a story and the importance of teamwork. The third book, A World to Explore, introduces Sam's new friend, Sarah, and shows how research is important to every budding author and illustrator. And in the new book, A Museum Adventure, I show what you can do with a journal while Sam and Sarah are having the adventure of a lifetime. Along the way, Sam and Sarah meet some unexpected new friends and discover how an artist with a special fondness for mice might take a fresh look at the work of the old masters. Sam and Sarah learn that explorers can write and writers can explore too, and an adventure can give you some great things to write about. Be sure to read Library Mouse, A Museum Adventure, 